Here it is. We are on the water. This is magical. This is the most spectacular place in which to eat a banh mi. Let's give it a try. Yeah. Once again, I'm on the run. Far away from all the fun. Today, we are going on another fun food adventure. This time, we are in the Mekong Delta in a town called Gang Te City. Nailed it, where we are at the floating market. And let me tell you about this market. It's like a normal market but it's on the water. Is that accurate? Yeah. This is the final chapter in our Mekong Delta tour series. Already I've learned how to climb a coconut tree. Here we go. Was that good? Sampled some tasty fried gourami. Whoa! Caught a snake. You got caught in a net. That must be like a crappy day for you. And we even cooked a chicken in mud. I couldn't imagine how you could cook a chicken in mud, but we've done it. So be sure to check out the full Mekong Delta video playlist. Oh, God. Oh. Today, it's all about one of Vietnam's famous floating markets. We gotta check out our food options while we're here. Right here is a breakfast boat. Can you slow down? Oh, look. Can you slow down? Can, it, can you tell them to slow down? Okay, we're not signed up. Kai Rong is a huge wholesale fruit selling hub. And by 6 a.m., it's already packed with boats. Look at this, she's preparing some soup. Wow, that's the way to eat. She's right. giving it to that guy up there. I'm here to try some of the amazing and unique local food and to take a closer look at life on a boat. So every single boat you can see the bamboo stick, bamboo pole. They're on the top, they hand a product and they are selling for advertising. Really? Right. So from far away, the customer can see it and get closer to buy the stuff. What is that? That is sweet potato. Sweet potato? Yeah. Oh. And pumpkin right there. Okay. Right. Oh my god, that's awesome. Oh, they sell crab right there. Or some boat, they sell a lot of stuff you can see. On the bamboo uh, pole, they have many yeah. different stuff. Yeah, and they put it all in the bamboo pole. That is brilliant. I never would have figured that out. <laughs> and for those standing boats, you can see, they normally stand in a group of three or four boats like that, so we yeah. know that they are on family related. So this is a family of yeah, boats? Yeah, just like the family, the whole one right here. It's about 6 a.m. right now. Can we roll up somewhere to get some coffee? Of course, yes. I've never gotten coffee in a boat, but I imagine that somehow it's much better than just coffee on land. This is a coffee boat? Yep. Yes. Yeah. You see, not only coffee, but they have soft drink. Energy drink. Oh, Ji Oi. Cafe Da Kong Dung. Cafe Da Kong Dung. Oh, yeah! Uh, only one time, very good. She got it right after you say. Yeah. Oh my god. I'm right. pumped too. I thought. <laughs> 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 that was wow. quite a celebration. Yeah. Cafe Da Kong Dung. You want some coffee? Yeah. All right, she's throwing in some coffee. She's throwing some in. Đừng có nhiều sữa quá nha, vừa thôi vậy. Some condensed milk. Right. Yeah. Mixing it up a bit. Chưa 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 chị ơi, từ từ. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> Hello. Okay. What all does she sell here? Mình có những thức uống nào? Coconut, uh, soft drink, mineral water, coffee, uh, tea, beer, beer as well. Beer. She has beer. Yeah. Uh, what time is it? Oh, it's, it's almost 7, 7 o'clock. Right. I have a beer. If it was 5 a.m., I wouldn't be drinking a beer. That's crazy. It's almost, okay. but it's, it's almost 7 a.m. It's a good time now, right? Oh, that cold one? Uh, oh, just wait for a moment. Oh, right. yes. Oh, this one's been in water for five seconds. It's cold now. <laughs> what a magic, huh? So this is a pineapple yeah. boat? We can even climb up there on the top. Let's do that. It's pineapple oh. boat time. Oh. Right, okay. Oh, it oh, did that's... break. We are on top of a boat in the fruit market. This guy specializes in pineapples. Yeah. Does he know a, a, a good pineapple guy? Uh, of course, I think he does. He's, He's got an expert. We are here with the boat man himself. He's gonna give us a little house tour. I don't want to like invade his personal space or anything. All right. But if, if he's cool with it, then yeah. it's really interesting to me wow. to see how they live. So interesting, you can see over here. So oh, this, is, cool. this is kind of the master bedroom right here. Right. Huh? Wow, very tiny. And so when he sleeps, is he sleeping in this right room? Right here. This room, he's got like a few change of clothes, life vest. Right. He's got a cooking area here. Right. Some oh, window. Wow. Very nice. <laughs> he's got a window here so he can, you know, see the sunrise in the morning. On this side, he's got some batteries. What yeah. are the batteries powering? The lights, maybe? Yeah, for the light. Okay. Yeah, and so TV just... set behind you. Can see? Does he kind of have... fancy, actually? What? <laughs> he's got a Sony TV right here, too. This is not bad. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Absolutely fascinating. Thank you so much yeah, for really showing you. me a piece of your life. Yeah. yeah. Come on. Thank you. <laughs> on to the next food or whatever. 
What? Look at who, look who pulled up. Oh my God. It's another breakfast boat. This is so much fun. You can just sit down, roll around. Hi lady. Another beautiful breakfast boat has rolled up on us. And this lady has everything. Grilled pork. And what does she make? Bún thịt nướng. Bún. Ah yeah, you got it. Bún thịt nướng. Okay, so like grilled pork noodles. What is that one? Cái đó bún riêu hả? Bún riêu. The crab noodles, the fresh water crab noodle soup. The crabs that we caught in the pond before. Right. Those are the same kind of crabs that the they use in bún riêu. Yeah. And then they put tomato in there. Yeah, and tofu, and then the plucky that you like. Let's get one bún riêu. One bún riêu. Okay. And one uh, bún thịt, thịt nướng. It's just blowing my mind that this is all on a tiny boat, and it's just like a perfect. Cafeteria. She's got like tin foil all laid out. Right. So this is a bún thịt nướng. Bún thịt nướng. Right. I noticed she gave us this um, kind of ceramic bowl. Do people usually eat it here and then give it back? Yeah. So she's just gonna wait for us to eat? Yeah, exactly. I feel bad, like she's losing money no if we're problem. eating slow. Because the people right here, they have a very normally they have a very quick spread for us. Because okay. they need to work right after that. Okay, so well, we'll, we'll be quick. We'll her. be quick. She's prepared yeah. the bún riêu. Wow, look at that. Yeah. yeah. Come on. Bam, look at this. Wow. Two specialties of Vietnam that I haven't tried on my show yet. And this is bún riêu. Yeah. We've got a nice big piece of pork. pork. We've got blood cake. blood cake. This is more sausage. Yeah. Maybe there's tofu down there somewhere. Right. And uh, a little bit of internal organs, yep. some intestine. <laughs> okay, okay, that's good. good. She's looking at me like, yo, my intestines are always <laughs> clean, son. And then here, right. we have the bún thịt nướng. There's some peanut on yeah. there. Pickle. The normal rice noodle. Pickle stuff, like uh, pickle, pickle vegetable. Carrot. Yeah. Yeah. And then uh, this is the grilled pork. Yep. This video isn't as much about each food item as it is just the, the crazy experience here. You know. Right. Exactly. It's so it's so intense and overwhelming. There's all these boats, people coming up to you. Every time I see a boat steaming, I'm like, oh, what are they cooking in there? Let's give it a try. Some blood cake. You got some nudes over there. Okay. Cheers. Mmm. That's mm. a good quality blood cake. I like the fish sauce she added in here. Pretty good. Nice little piece of intestine there. A little bit of sausage. Oh, yeah. Mmm. Really good. If you just saw this dish, you wouldn't think, oh, he got that from a, a tiny boat. Okay, switch. Oh, beautiful. Mmm. Definitely refer that one. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure they marinate this pork in a little bit of fish sauce. Of course. So it has a nice sweetness to it. It becomes like a glaze on top. And then you have some of that burnt kind of charcoal flavor. Right. From grilling it over the mm. fire. It's so good. Oh, you prefer that one? Yeah. I prefer this one. About this guy. That is a very special guy selling lottery ticket on a boat. <laughs> These are <laughs> look at that. lottery tickets. Are you kidding me? So all over Vietnam, almost anywhere you go, you can find some people trying to sell lottery tickets, right. usually for how much? How much is a lottery ticket? Ten thousand or for ten thousand, like fifty cents, that kind of thing. Right. And here, even in the market, there's somebody driving around on this guy's has this tiny boat and he's still driving around selling lottery tickets. That's completely amazing. I'm gonna buy some for you. Let's get like 10, 10 lottery tickets. He's must be so happy. Look at this guy. This guy is a fucking champ, man. This is one of the oh. things I really love about Vietnam and Southeast Asia. Obviously, you said he was born without without this yeah. lower limb. Yeah. But he's out here hustling anyways. There's no excuses. Like whether it's selling lottery tickets or whatever, like he's out here, he's in the water, he's paddling around. He's selling tickets and he's hustling. Yes. And he's he's making a, earning a living for himself. Right. Like to me, that's super touching. I'm, and I'm I'm happy to support that. Come on, on. yeah. Okay. Thirty. Listen, I'm gonna give you five. Wow. Okay. And I'm gonna give the driver five. Yeah. Cho chú, cho ăn. All right. I hope one of you wins. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, on. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Bye bye. Cảm ơn chú nhiều. Yeah. Already, uh, I'm ready for a second breakfast. Yeah. Could you eat again? Second breakfast. Oh. <laughs> Jesus, oh. look at that. Still going. It's gonna chop someone's freaking head off. 
Oh my god, that looks so okay? dangerous. I see breakfast yeah, right here. Right, Steve. Ah, I knew it. Right. I knew there was gonna still be food. This is a banh mi breakfast banh mi, boat. <laughs> yeah. I love alliteration, I love and I love banh mi. Mok banh mi. She's yep. putting on a little bit pickle of pork. radish, pickle carrot. A little bit of pickle vegetable. She said that it's delicious. Yeah. She is telling no, us it's I'm delicious. Not, but look, lady, I already know. I'm confident. Yeah. Is this not the most adorable, cute little boat you have ever seen? A lady with her little banh mi case. She's got a plant over here. It's adorable. The feng shui in this boat is, is perfect. Wow. Come on. Bao nyu dian. Um, okay, hold on. 15,000. Yes? Mm. Yeah. All right, 15,000. Okay, look at this. This is what you get for 15,000 on a boat. We are on the water. This is magical. This is the most spectacular place in which to eat a banh mi. Let's give it a try. Yeah. Can't wait to hear your feedback, your mm. review. Ngang <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. This is the best banh mi I've ever had while being on a boat. How long has she been doing this? Yeah, roughly 20 years already. 20 years? Hold on. Let me stop eating and be a professional for half a second. It's nice to meet you. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. High five, Jim. Did high five you? Lan lan you Oh, we should get Let's shake hands. Oh, okay. She, she didn't know that before. All right. All oh. right. Yeah. Have you, am I introducing her to the high five? Yeah. She's never done a high yeah, five? she hasn't done it before. Guys, this is a big the moment. First time ever. She's never done a high five. It's time. Yeah, no, okay. Yeah. This is a culture exchange. Yeah, like I'm, she gave me a bun me. I'm going to give her a high five up top. Yeah, like again, this. again. Like this. Okay. <laughs> That's pretty good. That's pretty good for a first high five. Thank you so much for showing me around. For me, this experience has been nothing short of amazing. For you guys, if you're interested in this kind of experience, one trip, they are also putting on one day and two day tours to the Mekong Delta from Ho Chi Minh City. You get to see and experience so much of the real authentic Vietnam. If you want to find out more, links for that are in the description down below. We will see you next time. A peace. Once again, I'm on